Let's go to Washington now and senior White House correspondent Bill Plant. Bill, I know the president spoke about Egypt this afternoon, but the White House has been clearly frustrated all week long. Are they making any progress at all? Well, Katie, they sure hope so, but they don't know. Sources do tell CBS News that the U.S. is encouraging those talks between the Egyptian government and the so-called wise men. Their plan, as you'll recall, would have Mubarak remain president but transfer power to his vice president. And today, President Obama, for the first time, said out loud, almost, that it was time for Mubarak to step aside. Now, uh, I believe that President Mubarak cares about his country. Uh, he is proud, uh, but he's also a patriot. The key question he should be asking himself uh, is, how do I leave a legacy behind in which Egypt is able to get through this transformative period? Uh, and uh, my hope is, is that uh, he will end up uh, making the right decision. Now, the administration remains very much in touch with the Egyptian government. Secretary of Defense Gates spoke for the fourth time today to his counterpart, and the president has been saying for a week that it has to be a time when the transition process begins, as he puts it, now. But nobody in Egypt seems to be paying any attention. Finally today, however, the president said that for the first time, discussions about the transition have begun. Katie? All right. Bill Plant at the White House tonight. Bill, thanks so much.